people want to have good chemistry with the other person. That doesn't limit you to just friends. It doesn't lock you into marriage or a relationship necessarily. It also doesn't make you like a fuck boy and, and that you're just looking for casual sex. Okay, so it kind of like leaves you open to all possibilities. What's up guys, Johnny Anthony here from Johnny Anthony Lifestyle. Today I wanna to talk about what to do when a girl says she's looking for something serious on the dating apps, okay, on Tinder, on Bumble, on Hinge. Part of my Leads Machine product, which has a link in the description for my texting product, I have a sequence that asks them what they're looking for and they either will say friends, something casual, or a relationship, okay, and then I, I show how to proceed from there but what do you do when the girl says that she is looking for a relationship or something serious? Okay, how do you proceed if you yourself are not looking for a relationship? Should you just write the girl off? What should you do? Okay, so that's the topic of today's video. But before we continue, if you're not yet a subscriber, please subscribe below. Press the notification bell for alerts of new videos every single day. We're going with two videos per day, two value-packed content videos per day. And also, if you would like to finally have this all make sense and have a complete system and have a permanent solution for life in as little as a couple weeks, jump on a free 30-minute call with the link in the description and someone on my team will go over how we can get you extremely good extremely fast. Okay, the result rate is extremely, extremely good. In this program, most guys are sleeping with one to two new girls per week and putting about one new girl on rotation per week as well. So basically if the girl says she's looking for something serious or she's looking for a relationship, what I highly advise is that you say that you are open to that as well. Okay, that doesn't mean that's your sole focus. And by saying that, that doesn't sign you up to be her boyfriend or, or mislead her in any way. To be fair, even if you're looking for something casual, anyone is generally open to it turning into something more serious. Okay, so I'll say to the girl like, yeah, I'm looking to find someone with good chemistry and then go from there, but I'm open to it becoming more serious, okay? And that's not lying, that's actually true, okay? Because at any, any time you go on a date or any time you get to know someone more, you know, most people are open to it going in the direction of getting more serious. If you happen to click a whole bunch with her, if your personalities really line up, if there's a bunch of connection and chemistry, then of course it can potentially progress into something more serious. Now, let's say you go and you guys end up hooking up and then she's like, okay, like we should become boyfriend, girlfriend. You can still say, hey, like, you know, I'd like to get to know you more first. I don't like to jump into anything right away. I wanna make sure that we both really like each other and this and that. I don't wanna just jump in and make it serious. We've only been on one date. We've only been on two dates or three dates, however many you've been on. You can still reference that excuse and say, you know, I prefer to get to know you more before we make things official or this or that, okay? Um, then it's up to you from there. You can, you can see her a little more. You can tell her you changed your mind and you, you're not thinking about becoming serious anymore, but I don't think it's a big deal to say in the beginning that you're at least open to that possibility because that's not going to preclude you from going and dating her, okay? If you're like, oh, I'm just looking for casual sex or I'm just looking, you know, to have fun, then, oh, she's off the table and it's no longer gonna be an option, okay? But also, in some cases, you're going to run into her wanting to take things slow, her wanting to get to know you a whole bunch more before she does anything majorly sexual, et cetera, et cetera. But that can vary from a case-by-case -case basis, okay? I banged tons of girls on the first date that said they were just looking for friends. I banged tons of girls on the first date that said they were looking for a relationship. And I banged tons of girls that were looking for a relationship that ended up never asking for one, okay? Because how we had it was totally fine, where I would see them once a week and we would have a good time and then we'd go back to our, our normal lives, okay? And I, I, you can also hold the like, hey, let's get in a relationship question at bay by saying you're not over your last relationship, okay? So you can say, oh, my heart's not available yet. I wanna make sure I'm over the last thing that I was in so before we get serious. You can also say that you know, the excuse I said before, how you want to give things more time to get to know the girl better, et cetera, et cetera. But you can also blame work. You can say, listen, I'm working a lot. I don't want to commit something where I'm not going to have enough time to devote towards you or, or towards this thing here. But I like how we have it going right now. So let's get to know each other more and then, and then see what happens from there, okay? So kind of the lesson here is you don't really want to preclude yourself when the girl is asking, what are you looking for? You don't, you don't want to like, rule yourself out by saying something that's not compatible with what she's looking for, okay? So, 
you know, it, regardless of what she's looking for, I usually say I'm looking for something similar. Okay, that way you're not, or you can just leave it very ambiguous. If they say, hey, what are you looking for? I say, I'm looking for a girl I have good chemistry with, and then go from there, or let's see what happens from there, which anyone could agree with. Okay, people want to have good chemistry with the other person. That doesn't limit you to just friends. It doesn't lock you into marriage or a relationship necessarily. It also doesn't make you like a fuck boy and, and that you're just looking for casual sex. Okay, so it kind of like leaves you open to all possibilities. So by the same token, when she tells you what she's looking for, your, you know, this can fit in to, to your approach of looking at all possibilities, no matter what she says, okay? She says, oh, I'm looking for friends. Oh yeah, me too, at least to start, and then see where it goes from there. Oh, I'm looking for a relationship or something serious. Oh yeah, I'm open to something like that happening, but let's get to know each other first and see how it goes. Okay, so, and, and they might push back on you, like say you hook up, oh hey, I thought you were just looking for a relationship. Yeah, I'm open to it becoming, you know, in, in, in that form, I'm open to it going that direction, but, you know, hooking up is part of that and I wanted to see how our, our sexual chemistry was as well and I don't really know you that well yet, I'd like to get to know you more, et cetera, et cetera. So then you, you know, you're not necessarily like contractually obligated to now become official boyfriend, girlfriend, and she might not end up being the girl that you thought she was initially anyways, okay, because when they're saying, oh, I'm looking for something serious, you don't even know if your personalities connect yet. Okay, so, and say things do good, say you do get along very well and you do want to get more serious, then you have that option as well. Okay, you can make her a, a rotation girl, a main rotation girl, you can make her a monogamous girlfriend, etc., etc. Those would be your options at that point. But do not think that just because she says that or she says she's just looking for friends, that that's, that means she's off the table for casual hookups. Because I've, I've, like I said, for myself and for my clients, it doesn't usually matter. They say they're only looking for friends. If they're on a dating app, they're open to hooking up on some level, and they're even open to it being casual most of the time anyways, okay? They, even though that's kind of like the more PC answer, the more politically correct answer. Oh yeah, I'm looking for just one guy. They're not gonna say, oh, I'm looking to go get fucked by a whole bunch of dudes. Or, hey, I'm looking to just put you in the friend zone, and we stay friends, and like we can't touch or kiss. All right, so don't kind of take what they, what they say there with a grain of salt, these answers of they're just want, looking for friends or they're, they're looking for a relationship or even a husband. They're still gonna be open to most of the things in between, okay? So don't, don't be deterred. So if you'd like to learn the entire system from A to Z, please jump on a free 30-minute call. The link is in the description for that. Also, do not hesitate to hit subscribe and the notification bell to be alerted of new videos every single day so that you never miss new video releases, okay? Please like, comment, and share. Leave new video ideas down in the comments, and I will see you guys in the next video. Take care. Some do it for the income, but we do it for the outcome. Some of us are active while others just let their mouth run. No doubt, son, this is not just about fun. We will not be outdone by these cowards who shout scum.